A total of 169 New Zealanders have been recognised in the Queen's Birthday Honours List for their achievements in everything from sport to entertainment. But it's those who have devoted their lives to helping others who have received the highest acknowledgement. Kim Chisnell reports. Married to a millionaire, Rosie Horton could have spent her life with the other ladies who lunch. Instead, she's devoted it to charity. She's chairwoman of the Friends of Starship and over 40 years has worked with dozens of charities. Now a dame, she says the true reward is what she's discovered about people. I think that New Zealanders have an extraordinary generosity of spirit. And that comes through when you meet people at work in the not-for-profit area. Former All Black John Graham is now Sir John, although the boys of Auckland Grammar probably called him that for years. The former principal has been recognised for services to sport and education and says his teaching career was a lesson in itself. I am authoritarian and I, I couldn't avoid that. So I had to learn compassion to soften that. And, and, and realise that everybody's different and you can't treat everybody in the same way. It's not often we thank our politicians, but John Banks has been made a companion of the Order of Merit. You can wait 33 years and 13 elections to get a compliment. Uh, so it's a long, long time in the wilderness. But having said that, um, uh, it's very gracious, all of this. I never expected it. Gossip columnist David Hartnell has been made a member of the New Zealand Order of Merit for services to entertainment. Hartnell's chuffed and wants to thank whoever nominated him. If I could find out who it was, I might buy them a, a cocktail or two. But I don't know at this point, no. But I'm going to find out. I'm a good gossip columnist. I'll get to the bottom of that. <laughs> and it's that dedication that's made him the top in his field. Kim Chisnell, 3 News.